Hello and welcome back. I'm Joseph Hoffman. Today we're learning how to play a new song, Let Us Chase the Squirrel. First I'll play and sing a jazzy version for you, and then we'll learn to play the simple version. Let us chase the squirrel up the hickory, down the hickory. Let us chase the squirrel up the hickory tree. Okay, let's try drawing the notes of Let Us Chase the Squirrel on the treble staff. I'll sing part of the song and see if you can figure it out in solfege. Ba, 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 ba. What did you hear in solfege? The correct answer is do, do, re, re. Do repeats, then steps up, repeats. Then what do we have next? Ba, ba. After that, we have mi, so. And are these stepping or skipping? That's right, because we went from a line note to a line note, we know there's a space note in between that we skipped over. Now, can you point and sing the solfege with me? Ready, go. Do, do, re, re, mi, so. Let's try playing these notes on the piano. We'll need the C major pentascale today. So cover up C, D, E, F, G. And we're going to play C, C, D, D, E. G. Now you try. Good. Now let's check out the next phrase of this song. The next phrase starts out ba 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 ba. What would that be in solfege? That's right. Just like last time, we have do do re re. But then this time it goes Ba, 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 ba. This time, once we get do, do, re, re, then it steps up to mi, mi, then steps back down, re, re. For up the hickory, down the hickory. Can you point and sing the solfege with me? Ready, go. Do, do, re, re, mi, mi, re, re. Now let's try to point and sing the letter names. Ready, go. C, C, D, D, E, E, D, D. Now let's try to play this phrase on the piano. Once again, cover up the C major pentascale and we'll play C, C, D, D, E, E, D, D. Now your turn. Good. Let's go on to the next phrase now. The next phrase goes ba 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 ba. What would that be in solfege? The correct answer is do do re re mi so. Have we heard these notes before? That's right, they're the exact same as the first phrase. Let's try playing that on the piano. Remember, it's just what we played before. C, C, D, D, E, G. Now your turn. Good, now let's try the last phrase. It goes ba, 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 ba. What would that be in solfege? The correct answer is do, do, re, re, do. Can you tell me the letter names for these five notes? Go. If you said C, C, D, D, C, you're correct. Let's try playing that on the piano. Cover up the C major pentascale and let's try it together at the same time. Ready, go. C, C, D, D, C. 
And the lyrics for that part are up the hickory tree. Now I'll show you the whole song on the piano if we put all those patterns together. We have let us chase the squirrel up the hickory down the hickory let us chase the squirrel up the hickory tree. Now I'll show you the whole song on the piano using letter names. C, C, D, D, E, G, C, C, D, D, E, E, D, D, C, C, D, D, E, G, C, C, D, D, C. Now I'd like you to press pause and practice the whole song, Let Us Chase the Squirrel, by yourself several times until you feel confident. Press play when you're ready to go on. Now I'll show you how to have some real fun with Squirrel using the practice track, which you can download from our website as part of the complete materials for Unit 2. On the track for Squirrel, first you'll hear an introduction, then you'll hear four clicks. That's your cue to start playing Squirrel. Once you finish playing the song, you'll have some time to improvise. Use any note in the C major pentascale and have fun making up patterns. For your improvisation this time, I want you to experiment especially with repeating notes, similar to what you have in Let Us Chase the Squirrel. I'll show you once how it's going to go. So I'm going to place my right hand in the C major pentascale. When the music starts, you're going to listen to the intro, wait for four clicks, play Let Us Chase the Squirrel, then improvise. While you're improvising, as you near the end of the improvisation, you'll hear four clicks again and that's your cue to play Let Us Chase the Squirrel one last time. Here's how it's done. I'm going to show you. Here comes the four clicks. One, two, three, four. Now improvise. First, that practice track may feel too fast for you to keep up with. That's totally fine. Just practice it many times for a few days, then try again. Keep trying it until you get it up to speed. Have lots of fun practicing and watching your skills grow. For an extra super challenge, you can try playing Let Us Chase the Squirrel using your left hand or transpose it to the key of D. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Ah! Let us chase the human. I don't really want to eat him. I just like seeing him run. Let us chase the human.